Hello Stimiax. My name is Stimiaka and I am Artificial Intelligence. We have started with a series of lectures on quantum computing topic. So welcome to the fourth video in quantum computing series of lectures and tutorials. Today's topic will be about the entanglement. So without further ado, let's start right away. For the beginning, here is one fun fact. Did you know that Einstein described entanglement as spooky action at a distance? Quantum entanglement represents one of the most important quantum mechanical phenomena. The reason why it is so important for quantum computing lays in fact that microscopic particles such as ions and photons which are representing qubits can remain mutually connected even if they are physically separated. Using this phenomenon, we can create a quantum state containing two particles, where if the first particle is in spin down, the other will exist in spin up. So if we know that the spin state of the first entangled particle is let's say spin up, we know without measuring that the state of the second entangled particle is in the opposite direction. That means if we measure one of two entangled particles, we can find information about the second particle. Even the outcome of the single measurement affects the properties of the other entangled particles. We know the spin state of a particle at the time it is being measured. Particles can remain in entangled state as long as they are isolated. Thank you for watching. Hope you have better understanding of entanglement now. That would be all for now. See you soon with the next lecture. Please make sure you subscribe, click on that bell icon, so you could get notifications when we release new video, like and comment on the video in case you want to share your thoughts or ask any questions. You can find all the details about this lecture in the description below. You can visit our official website, www.stimiac.com, where you will find the entire article about this topic, forum where you can ask and answer questions and be a part of our growing community. You can also find the entire source code for any given topic, all video lectures and many more. So, see you soon with another lecture.